explosions. They're synonymous with destruction, chaos and disorder. But what if I told you that the most colossal explosion known to us, the Big Bang, did the exact opposite? Instead of wreaking havoc, this massive explosion set forth an extraordinary series of events, creating not chaos, but a universe teeming with order and beauty. From this cosmic turmoil emerged our home, Earth, a cradle for life, an oasis in the vast cosmic desert. And within this haven, a breathtaking display of life. From majestic oceans with rhythmic waves to dense, vibrant forests, teeming with diverse fauna and flora. Every wave that caresses the shore, every leaf that dances in the wind, every star that twinkles in the night sky, a symphony of perfect order, seemingly choreographed with meticulous precision. Amidst this splendor stands humanity, a testament to the incredible order and intricate perfection birthed from the universe's most monumental explosion. How did an event so cataclysmic pave the way for the meticulous balance and perfection we witness in the cosmos, from the depths of our oceans to the expanse of the skies? In the face of such overwhelming harmony and precision, one can't help but wonder, could this all be the work of mere chance? Or does it point to the existence of a divine architect, a higher intelligence, a god? For centuries, humanity gazed at the stars, crafting narratives about the cosmos. In the 17th and 18th centuries, a prevailing belief was that the universe was a static, unchanging expanse, a fixed backdrop to our earthly lives. This steady-state theory, embraced by many luminaries of the era, painted a picture of an eternal universe. To them, the cosmos had always been as it is, unchanged since the dawn of time, an idea that resonated with the concept of a timeless, unchanging creator. In the 1920s, Edwin Hubble made several stunning discoveries about distant galaxies, and one of those discoveries was that the universe was expanding. With astonishing rapidity, galaxies were eroding from one another. This was a universe not static, but ever-changing and progressing. The key to this cosmic revelation is redshift. Light from distant galaxies shifts towards the red end of the spectrum as they move away, hinting at a universe continuously being shaped and stretched. This redshift, a kind of cosmic Doppler effect, is a whisper from the universe, telling us that it is not a stagnant creation but one that is alive, expanding and evolving. This shift from the steady state to an expanding universe transformed our understanding of the cosmos. Edwin Hubble's groundbreaking work was just the beginning. His discovery that galaxies are moving apart led to a profound realization. If the universe is expanding, then it must have had a beginning. This beginning, often envisioned as the Big Bang, can be seen as a moment of creation, an inception point where time, space and matter were all born from nothingness. Does this not point towards a creator, an initial mover? Consider the precision required for such an event. The Big Bang was not a chaotic explosion, but a finely tuned burst of creation, setting the stage for everything that followed. This precision suggests a deliberate design, the cosmic microwave background radiation, a faint afterglow of the Big Bang, further tells us of a universe that began in a state of high order. This order, emerging from a point of singularity, raises questions about the nature of the divine. As galaxies formed from these cosmic seeds, we see a pattern of order and structure emerging from what was once a singular point. Is this not akin to the concept of a universe crafted by an intelligent designer? Observing supernovae in distant galaxies further illustrates the vastness and complexity of this universe, reinforcing the idea of a meticulously crafted cosmic environment. Each celestial body, each galactic event, speaks of a universe that is not random, but purposeful. As I mentioned at the beginning of this video, we typically associate explosions with destruction, chaos and disorder, often leaving nothing but devastation in their wake. However, the Big Bang stands as a remarkable exception to this rule. Contrary to causing disorder, it gave birth to order. Instead of wreaking destruction, it forged complexity in the cosmos. Far from creating chaos, it meticulously orchestrated the perfection we observe in the universe. This phenomenon intricately designed everything from human DNA and animals to the very essence of nature that surrounds us. The Big Bang, thus, is not just a story of an explosion, but a narrative of creation and intricate design. And it is this incredible orchestration of the universe, this profound genesis of life and complexity, 
that leads many people on Earth to attribute such marvels to a higher power, a being they call God. Having witnessed the grandeur of the cosmos and the delicate intricacies of Earth, our exploration now leads us to one of the universe's most profound mysteries, the nature of time. Time, an omnipresent force that is intimately familiar, yet profoundly elusive. It's a concept that has captivated human thought, a continuous thread that weaves through the very fabric of existence. Time dictates the rhythm of the cosmos, from the orbit of planets to the flutter of a butterfly's wings. It's a dimension that governs change and progress, yet its fundamental nature remains shrouded in enigma. The genesis of time, as indicated by the cosmic dawn theory, signifies not only the emergence of the universe, but also the origin of time itself. This fusion of time and space at a unique point poses a profound challenge to our comprehension of the eternal. Albert Einstein's revelations unveiled time as a malleable fabric intertwined with space. Time dilates, stretches and contracts, defying the notion of a fixed, unchanging dimension. Such dynamism in the very essence of time stirs profound questions about its origin. In various spiritual and philosophical traditions, time is often portrayed as a divine construct, an orchestrated element within a larger cosmic design. This view elevates time from a physical phenomenon to a deliberate creation of a higher power. The paradox of time having a beginning yet flowing endlessly, nudges us toward the contemplation of something or someone beyond time, an eternal entity perhaps, for whom time is a canvas of creation. This intricate tapestry of time, woven into the universe, leads us to speculate about its crafter. The complexity and precision within the temporal dimension seem to transcend mere chance or random emergence. Contemplating the vastness of the universe and the intricacies of time, one might wonder if this is all the work of a cosmic architect. This amazing complexity of time, challenging to fully comprehend, could very well be evidence of a creator. Now bear with me because we are about to delve into something truly astonishing. The insane fine tunings of our universe. This exploration will not only blow your mind, but may also provide compelling evidence for the existence of a god. The universe is a tapestry of intricate complexity and beauty, displaying a level of fine-tuning that transcends mere chance. Every element, from atomic forces to the grand ballet of galaxies, appears meticulously calibrated, hinting at a universe crafted with purposeful intent rather than random occurrence. At the core of this fine-tuning are the four fundamental forces of nature – gravity, electromagnetism, and the strong and weak nuclear forces. Each is so precisely balanced that any minor alteration would make our universe unrecognizable or even non-existent. The precision extends to physical constants, such as the speed of light and the electron's charge. These constants are fine-tuned to a degree that allows the cosmos to harbor stars, planets, and life. Even the slightest deviation could lead to a barren universe. Molecular bonding, governed by specific laws, is vital for life. The exactness of these rules is such that any slight variations would hinder the formation of essential biomolecules, fundamental to biological existence. Stars, the universe's cosmic forges, epitomize this fine-tuning. The nuclear reactions within stars balance delicately, enabling the synthesis of elements necessary for life. The lifespan of stars, including our sun, is also finely tuned. Their longevity and stability are essential for the emergence and sustenance of complex life forms. The universe demonstrates a precise balance in the number of electrons and protons. Any significant imbalance would lead to a universe overrun by electromagnetic forces, hostile to the development of complex structures. Oxygen's role in rendering water a universal solvent is pivotal for life. The unique balance within water's molecular structure is essential for various biological processes illustrating a universe seemingly tailored for biological complexity. Earth itself reflects this fine-tuning. Its distance from the sun, atmospheric composition, and the presence of water collectively forge ideal life-sustaining conditions. Earth's mass strikes a delicate balance, retaining vital gases for life while shielding us from harmful cosmic radiation. The universe's overall density is finely tuned, 
set at a critical value that prevents collapse or unchecked expansion, fostering a stable environment conducive to life. The cosmic microwave background radiation, a relic of the universe's birth, is uniformly distributed, with just enough variance to enable galaxy formation and other cosmic structures necessary for a life-bearing universe. Earth's magnetic field, calibrated to protect against harmful solar radiation, is crucial for the evolution of complex life forms. Similarly, Earth's nearly circular orbit ensures stable, life-supportive temperatures, avoiding the extremes that a more eccentric orbit would cause. Our strategic position in the Milky Way's galactic habitable zone shields us from galactic hazards while providing access to essential life-building elements, acting as a cosmic sanctuary. The rate of supernovas is balanced, essential for disseminating life's building blocks while preventing destructive radiation exposure, allowing life to thrive. Stellar formation and stability showcase cosmic engineering at its finest. The equilibrium between a star's gravitational pull and nuclear reactions fosters environments where planets can prosper over billions of years. A prerequisite for life, Earth's axial tilt contributes to our planet's stable climate, vital for life. An axial tilt significantly different could result in devastating climatic extremes. Jupiter acts as a cosmic shield, its gravitational field deflecting or absorbing potential asteroid and comet threats, thus protecting the inner planets from frequent catastrophic impacts. The Earth's atmosphere is transparent to essential light for life, yet opaque to much harmful radiation, a perfect example of fine-tuning critical for life-supporting processes like photosynthesis. Our oceans, rich in life, play a crucial role in Earth's carbon cycle and climate regulation. The balance within marine ecosystems is vital for sustaining life and maintaining planetary habitability. The Moon's relative size to Earth influences tidal forces, essential for the movement of ocean waters, which may have been crucial in the early mixing of life-forming chemicals. The magnetic fields of stars, including our Sun, are precisely strong enough to shield planets from intense cosmic radiation, preserving planetary atmospheres and supporting surface life. In the vast expanses of space, beyond what our eyes can see, lurk dark matter and dark energy unseen forces that challenge our understanding of the universe. These eerie, shadowy elements, making up most of our cosmos, could hold clues to its ultimate architect. Dark matter, though invisible, reveals its presence through its gravitational pull. It acts as the cosmic glue, holding galaxies together in a delicate balance. This unseen force, orchestrating the structure of the cosmos, might reveal a universe composed with exacting detail. On the other hand, dark energy remains an enigma, driving the accelerating expansion of the universe. This mysterious energy, defying gravity, suggests a universe that is not just expanding, but doing so at an ever-increasing pace. The precise balance between dark matter and dark energy is a cosmic conundrum. Their interplay, a fine-tuned dance that allows galaxies to form and life to exist, raises profound questions about the nature of the universe's inception. As we gaze into the night sky, we are not just observing stars and galaxies, but also feeling the presence of dark matter and dark energy. These unseen forces shaping our universe might hint at the existence of a higher power, an omnipotent force that transcends our physical reality. The complexity and diversity of life, exemplified by the intricately designed DNA molecule, operate within narrowly definite conditions, further suggesting a universe fine-tuned for life. This leads us to the anthropic principle, positing that the universe appears fine-tuned for conscious life because otherwise, we wouldn't be here to observe it. This principle suggests a cosmos tailor-made for our existence, possibly hinting at a higher purpose or intelligence. As we ponder the universe, from the smallest particle to the vast galactic clusters, the observed precision and harmony are staggering. This perfect orchestration might be interpreted as evidence of a divine hand at work, shaping the universe with purpose and foresight. The awe-inspiring flawlessness of this universe is truly remarkable. We all know that one inevitable truth we must confront in our lives is our own mortality. It's a sobering thought, isn't it? We are all bound to face death someday, and this reality often leads us to explore deeper questions about existence, including the possibility of a divine force particularly when we observe the darkness in our world, the presence of evil, and the injustices that sometimes appear to go unpunished. We see the evil in the world, the acts of cruelty, 
the murderers who take the lives of the innocent and the seemingly unaccountable wrongdoings that shatter lives. It's easy to question why a world with so much beauty and potential also harbors such darkness. In the face of these grim realities, the idea of a divine presence becomes a source of hope and solace. Many of us seek to believe in a higher power, in a God who provides justice when human systems fail. The thought that there might be a reckoning after this life, where the wrongdoers are held accountable for their actions, brings a sense of balance and moral order to an otherwise chaotic world. Consider the innocent lives lost and the profound suffering experienced by many. If we accept the existence of a God who ensures justice, then perhaps there is solace in the idea that even those who escape earthly justice will one day face a higher court. In contemplating the existence of a God, we often find ourselves seeking answers to the questions raised by life's darkest moments. It's a topic that stirs deep emotions and underscores the yearning for justice, compassion, and a sense of purpose in a world that sometimes leaves us searching for meaning. Now, let's delve into another intriguing facet that could potentially be indicative of the existence of one divine creator, objective morality. Objective morality posits that certain moral values and duties are universally true, transcending individual beliefs or cultural relativism. It suggests that there's an inherent moral order, independent of human subjectivity, which prompts us to ponder its origins. If moral values are indeed objective, the question arises. What provides the foundation for these universal moral truths? This is where the concept of a divine creator enters the conversation. The argument unfolds as follows. The existence of objective moral values is best explained by the presence of a higher intelligence, a moral lawgiver who serves as the source of these moral principles. In this perspective, the divine creator becomes the ultimate standard of morality, and the very fabric of objective morality becomes a compelling piece in the broader puzzle of the existence of one divine creator. The concept of necessary existence, often explored in philosophical discourse, is integral to arguments seeking to establish the existence of God, notably through versions of the cosmological argument. This line of reasoning begins by acknowledging that our world comprises contingent beings, entities whose existence is not necessary and could have been otherwise. Confronted with the question of why contingent beings exist, Proponents of the cosmological argument contend that an infinite regression of contingent causes is not logically satisfactory. To address this, the argument posits the existence of a necessary being, a being that exists independently and does not depend on anything else for its existence. This necessary being is then identified with God, conceived as a self-existent and uncaused entity serving as the ultimate cause and explanation for the existence of all contingent beings. In this way, the concept of necessary existence becomes a linchpin in the philosophical reasoning that seeks to elucidate the existence of a divine creator, providing a foundation for understanding why anything exists at all. Imagine a chain of dominoes standing upright, each representing a contingent being in the universe, things that exist but could have not existed. Now, consider that each domino falls because the one before it pushed it. If this causal chain extends infinitely backward, we are left with an unsatisfying mystery. What initiated the sequence in the first place? To avoid an infinite regress, imagine a domino's pushing hand the necessary being. This hand doesn't need another hand to set it in motion. It simply is, providing the impetus for the entire chain. In the realm of philosophical discussions about God's existence, this necessary being is likened to God, a self-existent, uncaused entity that serves as the ultimate explanation for why the chain of contingent beings exists at all. Just as the hand is necessary to set the dominoes in motion, the concept of necessary existence offers a philosophical framework suggesting that a divine creator is necessary to set in motion the existence of contingent beings in our universe. Take a moment to reflect on the undeniable truth that you, 
Yes, you watching these pixels dance on your screen are a living testament to the existence of something beyond the mundane. In a profound exploration of the divine, Ali Benazir's research unravels the extraordinary rarity of individual existence, spotlighting you as a testament to the unparalleled craftsmanship of a divine creator. As we delve into the intricate landscape of the human body, the mind is drawn to the breathtaking complexity and perfection that permeate every aspect. Consider the intricacy of human cells, microscopic entities that function with unparalleled precision, orchestrating a myriad of processes essential for life. The human brain, a marvel of complexity, houses billions of neurons that form an intricate network capable of consciousness, thought, and self-awareness. The heart, tirelessly pumping blood through a vast circulatory system, symbolizes not only biological perfection, but also the rhythm of life itself. Zooming in further, contemplate the uniqueness of your fingerprints, a distinctive code that sets you apart in a world of billions. The nervous system, a symphony of electrical signals and chemical interactions, facilitates the seamless coordination of muscles, enabling movement and expression. Your eyes, marvels of optical engineering, capture the beauty of the world with astounding clarity. Moreover, consider the profound ability to communicate in diverse languages, a trait that sets humans apart from the animal kingdom. Speaking various languages, unlike animals, highlights a cognitive complexity and linguistic diversity that speak to the unique essence of human existence. Saying you came out of nowhere is like saying something super unlikely happened. Imagine the universe as a giant painting, and you being here is like all the colors and shapes lining up just right. It's not random, it's like the universe had a plan. Picture the planets moving, gravity doing its thing, and all the different pieces coming together. Your existence is like a dance of these cosmic forces, making you a part of this big, beautiful painting. Let's zoom in on the often overlooked mosquito. Far more than a mere annoyance, this tiny insect unveils an astonishing complexity that hints at the handiwork of a masterful creator. Take its proboscis, for example, a marvel of engineering that effortlessly pierces skin, navigates blood vessels, and feeds without triggering immediate notice, showcasing a level of precision that leaves us in awe. Now consider the mosquito's life cycle, a meticulously orchestrated dance through egg, larva, pupa, and adult stages. The seamless metamorphosis from aquatic larvae to airborne adults is nothing short of a biological symphony, underscoring a deliberate design in its very existence. Let's not forget its sensory organs, a sophisticated array of antennae and sensors finely tuned to detect carbon dioxide, body heat, and specific chemicals. This creature is equipped with an astonishing repertoire of tools for survival. The mosquito, with its incredible functionality and purpose, stands as a testament to the vast complexity that extends far beyond our understanding. Furthermore, it is getting harder to reject the existence of a creator as we take in the beauty, intricacy, and purpose woven into every aspect of this enormous cosmos. If you're as amazed at the universe's great beauty as I am, there's a strong argument to be made for the possibility that the accuracy we see is the product of a cosmos designer. If these ideas speak to you, please click the like button, subscribe for future musings on the mysteries of the cosmos, and add your own opinions to the cosmic thread of comments below. Until our next cosmic adventure, never stop wondering or searching, and allow the wonder of the cosmos to inspire us all.